Hello, everybody. We are now live. Um, and today it's pause, and hopefully this will uh, all work because um, as far as I'm used to, Xbox servers and all of that are terrible, even when you're not playing on an Xbox. Um, today we are very lucky to be joined by a guest. Um, Sheev, say hello. Hello there. Um, and hopefully um, he's going to be able to demonstrate his absolute brilliant prowess um, inside you of Forza. You have got no chance. Yeah, absolutely no chance. Um, of losing. No matter what. Yeah, well, don't, don't spoil the fun. Um, Try my best. <laughs> Um, so, I mean, hopefully everything's going to work and we're going to have no problems and Xbox will all just work first try. Hopefully. But it, it, well, it's never worked first try, has it? Um, we've already had technical problems just trying to get, like, Forza to start. Yeah, it took a couple of attempts to get in. For both of us, which is never a good sign. Um, I'm currently enjoying my lovely photo mode. Uh, which is something I really enjoy playing around with. Um, I get to see a nice shot of my um, IDR. Um, there's one really cool thing you can do with this. Um, once you've exited photo mode, um, is if you get a nice braking zone like that and massively over brake, and then remember what the button is to go back into photo mode. This car, do oh, this car's almost boring, kind of. You can get the brakes to heat up and they'll become nice and hot, which does look really good. Uh, when you're in a car that does it, but oh, yeah, I'm in an IDR. I have carbon ceramic brakes. Of course, my brakes aren't going to um, heat up. That's just not what they do. Hmm. Should have remembered that. What car would be a better one to use? Um, you could use, I mean, anything road, really. Right. Um, so, or anything, anything that's like a normal road car that's reasonably quick. Mercedes E63S um, is probably always a good bet because uh, it's got decent brakes, and we'll give it a go. Um, big problem you get though is you've got to be able to build up enough speed, get the nice fun um, tire smoke. And then if I absolutely slam the brakes on, go and chuck it into photo mode. Yeah, not doing it. I'm trying to remember which car it is I first spotted it in. That definitely does it. I can't remember. I'm evidently not not good enough at the game. Um yeah, right. Le Mans car you've done it in before. I'll have done it in the 917. Yeah. Um which um, is probably one of my favourite cars in the game. Oh, I keep pressing buttons too quickly. Uh, now we've got to pick a f fun car to do, Ambleside Village Circuit, which, um, assuming nobody knows anything about Forza, is a really fun track that's way too tight. So I think we go for a fast car. Uh... Yeah, nothing uh, uh, nothing that'll embarrass me too much, so... Okay embarrass you too much. It's going to go for the IDR, aren't you? Um, yeah. Stream, I'm currently muted uh, on Discord, so he can't see this. So we're going to go in a Range Rover, which is my slowest car. Oh, it was Land Rover. Land Rover. My slowest car, which will hopefully level out the playing field a bit. Um, yeah, okay, I've, I've gone for a nice quick car. Of course, um, you're going to use the same car as me? Of course. Um, I see no way this no, is badly. I can see the car you've picked, by the way. I know you can now. Yeah. And I, I can also see it before I agree to use it. Yeah, but agree to use it. Otherwise... I, I, I will, don't worry. Otherwise, when we get into a different race, I'll just use a car I can drive and you can't that's really quick. Like the IDR or the 599 XXE. Which is a... 
No, two cars that between the two of them can win at any track. Ah, now we get to play loading screen simulator. Oh, that was a quick one. Getting Forza better. has some terrible loading screens for a PC game. Now, what do we bet that I lose? I th I'm, I'm reckoning I'm pretty likely to lose. Oh, we are doing the same car, so who knows? Yeah, and Sheev's definitely going to win. Uh, um, oh, yeah. Our levels are not representative. Oh, we started the race. Oh, I better start accelerating, shouldn't I? Forgot oh, to accelerate. 100% forgot to accelerate. 100% not deliberate, was it? <laughs> 100% not deliberate. I would never be deliberate. You see, this car is so oh, the quick. The speed of... Yeah. The speed of this car... You see, I wonder, am I going to have to break for the next corner? I don't think I'm going to have to break. Even I didn't have I, to break I then. didn't even lift off. That was flat out. I, I might have made a mistake. Because the only way I could possibly catch up would be to have a braking zone where I can beat you. So this, this might be cars that were the same speed. This isn't fair. I don't like this. Why did I pick this? This was a mistake. Watching also a, car a couple of Land Rovers go around a track at 30 miles an hour <laughs> is so entertaining. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, yours has hit 30? Um, okay. 40 now. I'm at 47, 8, 9, 50 miles an hour! I'm break. Cheat. What? Braking? Is braking cheating? No, going at 50 miles an hour in this <laughs> car. <laughs> Yeah, it's not the fastest car in the world. I have made a few seconds on you, just. Um, I'm I'm going to do what we call a sheave manoeuvre. Also known as a shunt. Don't tell me you're going to do my favourite move. Don't you dare break check. Don't you dare break check me. Don't break check me. Don't break check me. <laughs> I was so ready for that. If you gone, I would. I would personally not like to talk about what we've just done. What? What happened there? Oh uh, well, you see. Oh, I was going to try and drift that. I try. I tried to do a brake check, and you went past me, and I missed <laughs> checkpoint. <laughs> how did you miss the checkpoint? I, oh how well. Did you... uh, that's not something I'm willing to share. <laughs> I, yeah, I I would never miss a checkpoint. That's not fair. You're not meant to hit me. I need Michael Massey involved so he can red flag the race. Come on, get it around the corner. Oh, wait, I overcorrected because I was in, looking backwards. Oh, we're only on lap. Two going on to three. <laughs> yeah, I reckon my stream's going to be pretty disorientated by the fact that I keep flicking backwards and forwards between looking forwards and looking backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards and backwards, and forwards, and backwards over and over again. You're just trying to check to make sure I don't shunt you too much. Yeah, I'm a little bit scared of it. I should probably, like... Oh, I've not got look forward enabled. I can't, like, smoothly fade between looking forwards and looking sideways. Uh, backwards. Custom control schemes for you. The, no one can see my screen, so I don't have to worry about that. I did just drift this thing. But I made the small mistake of drifting it, so I was way too slow. And we both know you don't look backwards. <laughs> Otherwise that brake check would have worked. I look, <laughs> I've looked backwards once or twice. Twice? In my whole time playing. That sounds about right. How are you losing me? What's happened? You just made time on me. You've never done that before. Oh, and I've messed up. Ah, oh, I'm making beating me loads. Either that or I'm doing this for suspense. <laughs> I tend to do this for suspense, don't I? It's just usually I don't go this far back. I'm 2.3 behind. I don't know if I can make 2.3 up. Ah, I crashed. How good are you at driving in reverse? 
Reverse, better than you. So, how about, you know, you reverse in a normal car and I drive forwards in this? Well, there's one small problem with that. And that's, in and reverse, that... most cars can't even manage a third of their top speed when they're going forwards. Um, and I think with even you driving, I wouldn't be able to match that. I think I've got one of Forza's yeah, radios except for like, playing. Except for like the Regera. <laughs> yeah, I, I could beat you with that. I think you're going to win the first race. This is not setting What's up the right precedent. I, I meant to be showing that I can actually play games after Panda tried to embarrass me last time as much as possible. And kind of partially failed, I think. A bit. I mean, it wasn't as bad as expected. Okay, I can now see you. That's a good sign. That is, is it? It's a good sign for me. But I'm, I'm not sure it's that much of a good sign. Oh, you took the wrong line through there. Oh, God, you're that close. So you can see what line I'm taking. <laughs> I'm always that close. Um, I don't think I can make this much time up unless you miss a checkpoint. Well, that is normally what I do, so... Yeah, that's, that's your usual trick. In fact, I lost time on you there, and then made a load of time very quickly. Somehow. Did you crash? No, I actually didn't. That was like a crash amount of time to make up. Oh, you're pretty close now. And you're going well, you see, 10 miles an hour quicker than me. Close round here isn't... Really, really, like, close around here in a Range Rover. A Land Rover? These are Land Rovers, aren't they? Why do I keep saying Range Rover? Yeah. I read it as Range Rover the first time and then kept on repeating it. Um, like, this time normally would be really close in a IDR or something. And I'd be able to make this up in seconds. I'd probably be able to make up, you know, this distance in a corner. But it's a second and a half. I can't make a second and a half up. So you've won the first race. Especially not in two metres. Yeah. We are going to have to find something that I am better at. Um, which could be interesting. Um, sure you'll manage it. Yeah, which track am I, like, almost half decent at? I don't think there's any. No, I, I think I'm, yeah. I don't think there's any track I can actually really drive. Hmm. Maybe that would be apart from the Goliath. I reckon we can do the Goliath. Do you know how to I drive quickly uh, around the Goliath? I know how to drive the Goliath, yes. The Goliath, okay. We can do the Goliath. What car do we pick to do the glide? I uh, don't know if you noticed, I ignored the quickly part. <laughs> yeah, let's... Oh, we've got an all-wheel drive centre here. Oh, what's drives like? I can't remember I did this. I set this one up a while ago. Oh, and I've crashed before I've even worked out what's going on. Sounds about right. Yeah, that's usually your job. Somehow I'm only managed to crash in the loading screen. Yeah. <laughs> See, we can now introduce a bit more of a skill gap where there's a bit more car control required and then I think I have more of an advantage. All right. Oh. Well, first, um, falls a specific problem. What have you done now? Uh, it won't let me take you into a match. Because we're finding a Horizon Life session. Let's see if we can drift. Useful. Again. Yeah, really useful. This center just doesn't want to drift. You need to drift a bit. Oh, that's a spin, not a drift. But we can recover that. Hate cars that don't drift.
and it just wants to crash. Um, one interesting thing about the center in this game, um, for those of you that want to try and play this game and, and be, it'd be reasonably quick at it, is it's really twitchy. So that there, um, is it unsettling itself? And it makes it actually one of the harder cars to drive, which is a bit weird given it's the flagship car. But it, its twitchiness only seems to happen at the high speeds. And actually, if you get into uh, a stock center like this one, which I have driven a little bit more and have driven a little bit more around the Goliath in particular, um, you'll find actually at these high... Why am I not getting into an online session? Um, Xbox servers for you, eh? Yeah. Um, it gets really twitchy. So there you go. That's it. I'm gone. And it's actually quite a hard car to recover as well because it's so twitchy. And I haven't yet worked out exactly why that is. They get that's the twitchiness. Um, I am kind of purposefully trying to get it to twitch, so it isn't normally this bad. But it means it can be yeah. pretty nasty around some some tracks at yeah some speeds. Is it mostly the center that's twitchy, or is it a problem in a lot of cars in this game? It's mainly just the center that I can remember being this bad. Uh, a lot of the cars more suffer from being a bit dull, um, which is the problem that I have with a lot. Of, a lot of the actual um, all-wheel drive cars tend to be a bit too dull. Um, twitchiness is something that a lot of people think they want in a car, and a lot of people think that racing drivers want a car to be really twitchy. But actually, it's it's never really a good thing for anyone. Um, so no. Nobody who's actually a proper racing driver ever wants twitchiness. Ooh, what to drive? What to drive? Uh, all right, so out of my quick cars that I have um, up on the screen here, well, most of them. Uh, so the Senna's particularly twitchy. Uh, the CCX is very twitchy. Uh, the Regera is also quite twitchy. The rest of these, I think, are all right. And I think we're going to try driving a Veyron Chieve so that we can... S you know, hold me back at oh, least yes. a bit. That's a great idea, driving a car that we hadn't driven until uh, earlier this week. Yep. And a car that I'm not particularly good at, um, which is... What um, could go wrong? Absolutely nothing. And Oh, and it's not like we're on a particularly difficult track either. There's a particular corner on this track, and I'll probably say it when we get to it. That I really struggle with. Um, Pulled us into the uh, race there when I was in midair, so my car just slammed into the ground. <laughs> that sounds fun. Yeah, there's a particular corner that I really struggle with, which I don't know if my mouse will show up. It's this one here. Oh, yeah, my mouse will show up. It's this one here, bottom left. Um, it's that little corner there. It's really difficult to get right. It's, it's quite easy to get around, but it's really difficult to get it right. Um, and I don't know if I'm good enough to do it in a Veyron. Oh, that was breaking way too early. And we're drifting. I've had um, too much practice at trying to drift things. Now I just end up drifting them automatically. Fun, so, but not as good for speed. Yeah, it's really fun. It looks cool and it teaches you how to drive quickly because part of learning how to drift, you also have to learn how to not drift because otherwise it spins. Um, and so if you learn how to drift, you can learn how to stop a car from drifting, which gives you much better car control. Um, it's just... Uh, it means that sometimes you just drift accidentally. Have you had a bit of an accident? Over already? I've, yeah, I've hit a bit of a, a, bit of a Scottish pub. <laughs> You've demolished a pub. Um, I think the Scots are going to deep fry you for that. And ah, we. Right. Oh, never mind. I'm right behind you now. Yeah, I definitely didn't slow down. I forgot that you didn't have to break much for that corner. We're in trying... the same car. Oops. <laughs> um, I think that won't work for me. 
I went worse for me. I rolled. Oh, you went. You went upside down. I rolled, oh. so I had to wait to get rolled back around. I've rolled as well now. Oh, that's fun. Ah, ha, ha. That would never happen to me. Um, as I'm sure um, everybody watching can tell, there is absolute pinnacle of sportsmanship here. Have you crashed? Um, I have not crashed. <laughs> yet. Um, and and we, we both entirely value each other's skill. What are you doing out there? It's not the line you take through that corner. Um, and both fully respect each other. Oops, you think I have much choice what line I take through a corner? <laughs> I hit a wall. No I'm just way. reminding you I'm there. You don't break there. Why, why have you crashed? I didn't crash. It was a temporary argument with some scenery. <laughs> so just an argument. Okay, that's fine. I need some way of showing stream how much throttle I'm using so they can see when I'm lifting off and just letting you catch up. Oh, I've crashed. Oh, that was a big one. Okay, I might have to drive properly now to catch up. Don't you slow down. Just... You just drive this lap as fast as you can. We know how oh, much time I'm, I'm I... never. I'm never going to slow down, so you can overtake <laughs> me, am I? Because <laughs> we both know how much time I make up on you around this track. Um, what you need is like a GoPro just positioned over your finger and put that on the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Yeah, I haven't got a cable that could do that, though, which is really annoying. Because I've got a camera. I've not got the cable to be able to do it. And invisible bump. Whee! Got airborne on the bump. Slightly. I think I managed to miss it this time. Dude, had you, had, you must have been very much off the track there. I've never missed that bump. I always notice it. Oh, you might have been going slow enough that it wasn't a problem. I've done that one a few times. Oh, I know what we should do. We what? should do this this um, track with the Land Rovers. Oh, God. I don't think anyone watching <laughs> or us has the uh, <laughs> patience for that. that. <laughs> yeah. I don't think I do. I was getting fed up after a lap of that. You know, you've got to, you've got to start the stream with um, high-intensity stuff. You know, hook the viewer. That's actually the interesting thing about streaming, I think, from what I understand, is you've just got to keep it all high-intensity. And break for the corner that I don't normally bother breaking for. And break for the other corner that... Oh, wait, no, I didn't have to break there. That was all right. Get around that. Oh, and we're going to have to do loads of fancy breaking here. Oops, sideways. And lift and break 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 and break. Oh, hi. Now, does he know the yes, secret to it. get around this next corner quickly? Does he remember? I have told him. And will he mess it up? Well, he's already messed it up and he took the wrong line, which means he crashed. I missed a checkpoint. And he missed a checkpoint. Could that have gone any worse? <laughs> I'm not sure that could have and, gone any worse. I crashed on the second go round as well. Well, we've lost him. Okay, he's now on the map when I look backwards. <laughs> I've crashed into the bus stop. Oh, I'm just yeah, they're, they're really annoying bus stop that you can't smash through. Yeah, I'm just going to do some donuts. I can, see Donut. you, I can see you going about 50 miles an hour. I was doing donuts. You're not seeing me doing donuts? Yeah, I'm I went straight past you. Yeah, I probably should have done one less donut so that I was still ahead. Oops. I don't think we're going to set too bad of time here. We, I. And break! Heartbreaking and a little bit. Of... Ooh, 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 we're getting a bit of slide on. I don't know how I managed to drift a Bugatti Veyron. Well. I remember Chris uh, Harris saying on uh, Top Gear when he first drove the Chiron, he was really excited because he could drift it. I've never had any problems drifting this very on. Never had any problems drifting a shoe on either. In real life, or as you're doing it on the computer. Yeah. But from my understanding, I haven't driven my car in Forza and uh, in real life. They're actually quite similar. It's a pretty good representation if you know what you're looking for. Oh, I can't. Wait, you have a big gas you were on? Oh, yeah, of course. Got three. Um, what's actually funny is I can't remember how many Bugattis I have owned in Forza. Um, probably not helped by the fact that I can't even remember how many saves I've had. See, the 
This is even my th third or my fourth one, I think, but I'm not sure. Um, who who would know? I don't I think even think this is not right. Yeah. Um, I kind of got so for those wondering. Uh, what happened was, I got my pause up, I played it a lot, I unlocked everything, absolutely everything, uh, including, I think at the time, I owned Bamber Castle. Hello. Um, then I crashed. Uh, oh, we crashed the same way! Where have you gone? <laughs> over there. I went right into the sea. <laughs> I thought I'd done the bigger crash. That means you'll have rewinded, though. Oh. No, 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 no. I should have rewinded. No, 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 no. You've got the speed advantage on me. Okay, I think we're all right. I think we're safe. Yeah. So I played it. I unlocked everything. I was living in Bamber Castle. And then I changed something on my computer. Probably my SD card. SD card? SSD. Why did I say SD card? Um, and... When it came to reinstalling Forza, and it gave me that syncing save or something screen, I clicked the X because I didn't want to sit there and wait, and discovered that I'd lost all my data. And then I went, oh, I've lost everything. Uh, so I sat and played Forza a lot, uh, again, unlocked everything. This time decided I'd go and live in Edinburgh Castle, uh, unlocked pretty much everything. I had all but about 10 of the cars, again. and. Um, then I'd changed another thing or reinstalled Forza or something, can't remember. And uh, this time, I, again, said I didn't want to keep my save. So I started again. And that could be now this save or it could be another one. But over the iterations, I have amassed some several thousand levels in Forza and um, way too many hours and way too much money. So this save is a, in no way representative of my playtime. Put it that you know, way. I Oops. think this might be your fourth. Because I, when I managed to get the game last year, I think you reset as well. Again, for fun. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Yeah, it could be. I've been playing fun. three for ages. Yeah. So when I finally managed to get four, I got on Black Friday deal. And um, yeah, I think you reset at the same time. Yeah, I've also played three a bit. And I might have completed five. I can't remember. Uh, I will do a playthrough of five at some point. Um, probably in a few months. And probably play through the whole thing from the very beginning. Uh, because why not? Because um, it is a good game. I just I never really had the opportunity to get into it uh, when it came out. Just too busy. Like, yeah, too busy playing Battlefront. <laughs> Yeah, I have played a lot of Star Wars Battlefront 2. Um, and got quite good at it, and then forgot how to play. Which is the same thing that's happened in Forza, because I used to be really good at Forza. Now I'm terrible in comparison. Apart from apparently I can still hot lap. Um, so my Goliath time is quicker than it was, uh, which is this race. So um, it's not a particular secret that this is my favourite track and the one that I'm quickest around by quite an impressive margin. Um, and, well, Sheev, you know what our time difference is. Do you want to yeah, say it? Or? Right at the moment, it's uh, 9.416 seconds. Which is approximately a sixth of what it usually ends up being. And uh, the, well, 10.517 seconds it is now is, you know, the I point five one is incredibly important. Me. Well, it is a car that you barely drive. No, I think that's slow for me compared to in the P4, which is a much slower car. Can't remember, though. What's my P4 time? Is that the car for the benchmark? Yeah, I think, I think I'm a lot... Yeah. Go I get on this wheel spin. Oh, we're doing wheel spins. Oh, some random thing I've never heard of. Oh, an MX-5. What have you got one of that? Um, Probably. Probably got about 10 of them. Definitely had one before. I, th 
I'm not sure. I don't know if there's any car in the game now that I haven't owned at some point. There's a lot I haven't driven. Whether or not there's any I haven't owned. I wonder where should we go next? Why are these menus so slow? I like to I like to use menus quickly. Play Minecraft Java. I'm used to things being instant. Just pick a race I haven't done before. That race looks fair. We don't want to do that one. That's the one that I really like. What one? One that comes down the Holly here. Rude. I really like. You're thinking of Hollywood? That's this one. Isn't it? I, I don't, which one's Hollywood? Uh, oh, no, Hollywood. That's, that's in Edinburgh, actually. Never mind. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like that one as well. There's a, there's a couple of tracks that I really like. And I was thinking we could try out the MX-5. Or as the Americans like to call it, the Miata. I have no idea how this works. Oh, that's a fun track. Get some nice I don't know, I, I just, at this point, I just read Miata as MX-5. Yeah. Drive the Bugatti flat out, see if we can drift it a bit. No, I'm definitely going to use the car that you pick. Why do I feel like I need to pick the IDR, then? Do I pick the IDR? No. I, I will, I, I'll go for what you pick. Maybe. I think I overshot my race a bit. Maybe. Fine. Yeah, that's fine. I don't mind. Uh, I don't want to do one of them. I, want I think to. I'll, uh, let's see what I got. Manufacture. See how fast I can read where we Ooh, are. Oh, Morris Minor. That's a good car for me to drive. <laughs> Every, uh, chat, I've changed the game mode so that we're on the same team. And that way, it doesn't matter what car he drives because he's on my team. And yeah, there's absolutely no chance we're gonna uh, have changed anything at all. I've not not done any clever little things to make my life easier. And would you like me to use your car? Hey, you're welcome to use whatever car you would like. Okay. Whatever that may be. I hope. I hope it's something decent. I hope I'm not gonna regret saying that. You're not gonna make me regret saying that, are you? Well, seeing as you uh, set it, I think, as Japanese cars, and I only had about three to choose from. <laughs> GTR. Um, chat also, we're against the unbeatable difficulty, which he hasn't played against before. Um, so this could be really fun. I don't know if I'm good enough to win this race, though. So yeah, this will be really, really fair and easy. Yeah. Why did you pick a... Di a D class car. Oh, oh, and don't worry. The um, the difficulty is really low. What's the difficulty? It's really low. Why is it? We are so gonna lose. All right, oh, it's not a problem. And he's already overtaken me. Oh, this could be interesting. And. I'm just going to have to drive this car as fast as I can. Well, these AI are a bit aggressive because they're not supposed to nudge you. Oh, are they? Yes, we're getting an overtake on. Is that a Torino? I think it's a Torino. Toyota Torino, I think. I didn't read, I didn't read what options the AI I picked from. Um, chat, we do not talk about where we are coming at all. We're getting an overtake done. You know, it's a bit embarrassing for you that I'm within six weeks of you, given how much faster your car is. Yeah, mine's a B uh -oh. and yours is a D. We're going to have to brake. Braking is not good in this car, there because that means I then have to accelerate. Currently winning currently as well. winning based on how the points are done. Wow. I mean, it could be winning by a bit more, but, you know. Yeah, why aren't you winning? You're in the quick car. 
Is this how we yeah, made this? The AI cards are quick as well. <laughs> yeah, but they're really easy AI. What are they? What are Chat, the AI don't on? tell him. No one tell him. No one tell him. Does anyone really, know? Really easy AI. Definitely no chance that I'd put them on unbeatable. I can't be unbeatable because I'm beating them. I know, which is weird. I thought I'd set it to unbeatable. I'm going to have to check that. I really thought that was on unbeatable. That's what I usually play against. Unless it's from last time I played with you against AI. I had to turn oh, it would have been on highly skilled for the seasonal event. Yeah. For you. Baby mode. Oh, this car's slow. Not even that fun to drive. Because I can't do anything fun in it because it's too slow. And we'll at least finish sideways. Or backwards. Backwards is more fun. See, I finished sideways, but, you know, no one got to see me finish, so that was a bit of a waste of time. <laughs> what you mean is you finished sideways, but not on purpose? I chose to finish sideways. I believe you. I fully believe you. Right. Finishing sideways is always fun. Yes, it means you're like... It means you're sideways. What isn't fun is if you finish sideways and you're so busy showing off that the next person overtakes you. I have never done that. I've, done I've that never done that. that. I've, I've seen other people do it, though. I've done it more than once. <laughs> I've seen people do it in real race. <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah, that's all unbeatable. Hmm. It is? Yeah, I'm more surprised than you are. Let's see, what looks like a fun race? Plot armor. You think you've got plot armor? Okay. That's the I'm in a Fast and Furious car. <laughs> <laughs> Next you'll end up in space. Yeah. Is it worth trying to drive this car around here? Is it quicker to drive than MX-5? A kilometre to the next race, or to change car and drive that there, the loading screen. I'm not sure. Because this thing is so slow. I'd change. Uh, I'm just going to drive it quicker. And then I reckon we'll just come across that. Actually, yeah, it was quite quick. After the fact that it has no brakes. Oh, did co op again. Make a fun car. What's a fun car? Fun. That's, yeah, fun cars. Oh, wait, I didn't mean to pick that car. Oh, well. I meant to pick the Pagani. And no, I will not attempt to say the name of any Pagani apart from a Zonda on stream. I am not embarrassing myself with my lack of ability at pronunciation of. That. Not even going to attempt it. Uh, oh yeah, so you're in a Pagani, are you? No, I'm in the. Uh, no, I'm in the GTR. I meant to pick the Pagani. I'll go in a GTR with you. Okay. I mean, the GTR and the Pagani of these specs are the same speed. The reason I wasn't going to pick the GTR is because it's all-wheel drive. So I automatically hate driving it because it's too easy. Um, and no one likes things that are too easy to drive. What's what's that? that? Oh, that's the uh, Russian Cube One. The Russian? Never heard of that before. Neither have I. Who makes it? Russian. I've never heard of that. <laughs> Neither have I. I need to go and get that car. I might have owned it at one point. And the delight of driving an all-wheel drive car. Why did you just... We're on the same team! I didn't do anything. That was the AI. You blocked me. Uh, I'll tell everyone a secret about the AI. They're really bad 
at not breaking the corners that you don't have to break. So the easiest way to overtake them is to pick somewhere where the racing line says you have to break, but you, you know you don't actually have to break. Oops, I forgot to lift off there. And then you can just breeze past them. They're also really good braking um, aids, shunting into the back of them. Oh, yeah, it's very clean racing. Yeah, really clean. What? I didn't, sh right, I didn't intentionally shunt into that one. I blame him for that. I'm definitely not just closing him off a bit. I shunt one into the river. <laughs> Did you? Wow. No, <laughs> I uh, try to. Oh, okay. I'm not that good. I'm not that violent either. Okay, that's a wall. I didn't mean to hit that. No wonder. Is rear wheel drive or all wheel drive quicker through here? Rear wheel drive. Falls a pinnacle that. of realism. Doing 91 miles an hour through a water splash. Oh, a yeah. Prolonged water splash. That Wait, would you rip don't do that every day in off. real life? That would literally rip your car into pieces. Joke. Oh, that was tight. What, what are you doing there? You're meant to be further oh, back than that. Oh, I'm not. We're winning. Oh, is this what happens? The minute there's video evidence of how you play, you start playing really well. Yeah, I've just pretended to be rubbish all these all these months. Yes. I, I might not be able to overtake this last AI. I'll still win. Yeah, but I might not be able to overtake him. Oh, wait. There we go. Got him. I spotted my opening where I knew he'd break and I wouldn't. What's he doing over there? Get there? What do you mean? Yeah, I don't know. I have no overtake. Oh, okay. I thought you'd crashed or something. Wouldn't be a surprise. No, it wouldn't match if I had, to be honest. Yeah, because I'd already won it for us. God, oh, come in third place. Letting the side down. Um, I seem to remember winning last race. I don't remember that. The, the reason um, the reason I'm doing a lot better now compared to normal is because now I'm not playing another game at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> I some, I know I sometimes I have a mobile game open as well, <laughs> just for like the loading screens. Is it, isn't that what you do? I, I do that too. Usually I'm messaging someone. Mm -hmm. And I would definitely not have um, any form of social media up at the same time as I'm streaming. I definitely don't have WhatsApp open on my laptop. Um, and I definitely don't message people during the stream uh, at all. That, that would be completely yeah, unprofessional of me. I'm definitely not playing any uh, iMessage games with people. I'm going to pretend to know what you mean there. I'm going to guess that's some kind of Apple thing, so I have no interest in it. Yes. Ooh, what can we do to make this race interesting, then? Hmm. I've no idea. Do I? This car, this race is only really fun in a car you can actually drive, though. Like, properly drive. Let's see if we can drive this one. Yeah, give this car a go. What there car? What? What car? Uh, Zenvo ST1. Ooh. I like that one. Yeah. It does a lot of wheel spin. Oh, I have got the radio on. And quiet. That's better. After having played this game for so long, and now knowing every single track on all of the radios, I do not want to listen to them anymore. It does drift quite well. I got a lot of timeless FM, though, on this. <laughs> That's the classical music one, isn't it? Yeah. Especially as they don't even bother, like, queuing the pieces properly. It'll just randomly switch to a different piece. Yeah.
Right. Let's see how this goes. CCAS. M600. M600's good. Wonder if the stig's gonna crash that thing. I wonder if it does the that that's called going sideways. I will spin already. How am I meant to overtake if you're just blocking the entire track with your wheel uh, spin? I'm going to miss a checkpoint there. Are you overtaken now? Yeah. I saw well, an I'm thinking of a different car because I really like this. I thought I really like this car in three. That's because you can't compare three and four. Oh, uh, that was a slide where there shouldn't have been a slide. We do not like sliding there. I am always a fan of going sideways until I don't mean to be going sideways, and then I hate it. Yeah, the problem with this car, I think, if I can remember correctly, is A, it's not as cool as its um, successor, um, and B, it has way too much power. So it likes to slide way too much if you're a bit aggressive on the throttle. And I am, of course, always a bit too aggressive on the throttle. Oh, and it's got a really dull front end, apparently. A high speed. So I crashed. I need to remember the fact that it's got a dull front end at speed, and that, that means you have to... Um, mass massively missed checkpoint there. So yeah, what I mean by it's got a dull front end, um, or you can describe it as like having a heavy front end or something, is basically it just understeers at high speed. And it just isn't very fun to drive, usually. Um, and I forgot this car was like that, because I didn't think it was. Um, um, it means that you're very likely to crash it. Uh, but what's very interesting, and not a particularly desirable trait, is the fact that this car has a very dull front end at high speed, uh, but at low speed, it's got a very, very, very overactive rear end, which means that there's a speed that I've not yet worked out what it is, but it's probably not that fast, where it's completely impossible to keep it um, in check. And I missed a checkpoint. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, no. So it, so it might not win this one, I'm almost at the back. This is not going as planned. I feel like I need to go and like demonstrate my skill in a car and a track combination that I can actually drive again. There's no, no fun in just doing something you can do, though, is it? you got to do something you can't do. No fun in winning all the time. No, absolutely no fun at all in just winning everything all the time. That's definitely not how I got through 500 hours of co-op in Stars Battlefront 2. Ooh, 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 the AIs have had a crash. Yes. My opportunity. We're still losing, though, aren't we? Yeah, that's not my fault, now. Please, 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 please. That's such a dull front end at high speed. And all of a sudden it gets way too light. Oh, thanks, AI. That's my trick. Yeah. I would have, if it was only me, have drawn with the AI. So I, I accept no responsibility for the fact that we lost. Well, if you'd have just won the race like you normally do, then... Uh... Right, that's it. Have you finished yet? Okay, yeah. Yeah, just about. What we're going to do is we are going to get into my favourite car to drive and we are going to do my favourite track. Uh, you can pick anything up to 950, by the way. Okay. Right. Which um, it basically means I'm telling him he can pick any car he wants up to the class of 950, because uh, I think that'll be about fair. Oh, but that'll make the AI quicker as well. Ugh. Anyway, yeah, anything up to 950. I'm being what generous. Are you going in? What do you think? Oh, no? Yep. I am going to pick 
I have for everyone watching. This one. And I did not pick the paint on it. It's the paint it came with. It's not my type of paint. Uh, cars. Tune car. Arrow. Let's make you a little bit more top speedy. Um, oh. Well, this could be interesting. Uh, saves a bit of time, and I need to upgrade anyway. Push it to 962, so I can drive an i8. What kind of i8 is 962? What I've got. Okay, and this is going to be an entirely stock back mono. Oh, oh, yeah, actually, that's good, that's good, that's good. We can take some weight out. Actually, I don't want to take more weight out of the back mono. The back mono is light enough. What it needs is some power. I'm going to guess that none of these power upgrades are going to bring it in under my threshold of 900, which is just great. So we are going to have to make do with... I don't need suspension. So, oh, seven kilograms, that'll do. Most of it's from flywheels, so that'll lower our reciprocating mass in the engine, which will mean we will be quicker. And quicker is better. 84. Yep. And that's our realistic top speed. We're not going to get any higher than that. Let's see how quick this is. Ooh, that feels different. Oh, I don't like how light the suspension is, or soft the suspension is. Even we use the right words, haven't we? Well, is it still driftable? Oh, that's my problem. Oops. Pay more attention on driving rather than trying to see what car's doing. I'm trying to see how mobile it is. That's yeah, so what I'm going uh, in the IA. Wee. Maybe a bit tuned up, but Just a little bit. What is the stock? Is it about nine hundred? Uh, no, in eight fifty four. Oh no, I'm miles off. Seven eight five. <laughs> What's eight fifty four then? I got something that's eight fifty. No, I haven't. Must have had something that was 8.54 at some point then. I blame my um, terrible memory. Right. Oh, that's probably why the suspension looks terrible. It's got less downforce. It's not compressing the suspension as much, so it's, it looks really light. Oh, definitely won't. I should do. I'll uh, have faith in my tuning ability. Oh, yeah. There we go. Red hot brakes. Nice, blurry, red hot brakes. See, told you it does that. <laughs> it would not be fair to limit him to track toys, so we are going to have to have a custom event. Oh, this takes forever to set up. Why does this take so long? Such a slow thing to do. Oops, don't want that. Don't want that. Don't want that. Okay. 
And we want one lap in summer, um, early afternoon, cloudy, no time progression. And you can't. Got there in the end. Oh, and it's playing audio for me, so I'm going to talk over it so that everyone doesn't have to put up with it. Uh, I'm drawing my back. Why am I waiting for players? Oh, don't tell me I forgot to set it to convoy. Oh, uh, now I have to delay for 20 seconds. Or 30 seconds longer than I normally would. Oh, this is representative England, isn't it? Oh, we won't let me do it. The cycle lane only being half proper surface. That is so something you see in England. I would know, having had loads of problems on cycle lanes. Just what I love. Ah, finally we're in the event now. Yeah. I should... Hopefully... Um, be better. Right. There we go. Oh, what? Have I got to race an F fifty? That's what happens when I pick a really good car, what? This was meant to be me winning. Oop. Ah, my... Ha! Ah. My controller wasn't working. Well, that means I can beat you. And break! Less than the other guy, that's always a good sign. And he's got more top speed than me. See, always it's a good sign if you're having to break later than the other guy. And oh, I already slowed down for that corn. No. Oh, okay. We're all right. You've crashed. This isn't a Goliath, is it? I said it was a track that I like. I thought there were multiple tra tracks that you like. Yeah, but a track that I like a lot, it has to be the Goliath. Uh, looks like I'm not going to win this one. Oh. But what I do know is you're certainly not coming past me. I will not stand for that. I will do everything in my power you'll, to block you. You'll sit for it. <laughs> yes, I will not sit for that. Oh, this car is so slow! It's so slow in a straight line. I need more power, but I don't have more power. But what it does mean is I am way quicker than everyone else in the corners, which is always a good thing. And if I come out of the corner 50 miles an hour faster than everybody else, at least I have to do 50 miles an hour less acceleration. Even if my top speed is 100 miles an hour less than some cars. What I need now is the AI to crash. Yeah, don't worry, they're quite good at that. Uh, just on this... Um, next left hand bend that they're going to do uh, in front of me that's where they usually tend to like crashing what? none of them crash there they usually love crashing there I've seen loads of AI crash there and loads of players and me I've crashed there a lot alright we're now getting into the bit where I can make up some time ok one of them has crashed two of them has crashed three yeah they four. tend to crash in herds they do crash in herds Got to see, uh, yeah, sneak in the quotes. Very subtly. 
How are they so far ahead of me all the time? Not like I'm driving slowly. Oh, this is probably the bunch of cars that have been spawned so that you would have someone to race against. Yeah, that must be it. Which is why I'm ending up racing against them. And all the cars I'm racing against are the ones meant for you. Yeah. Bop! And um, we get the bump. Boing. Nearly missed it. Only caught one wheel on it. And... Late breaking into the corner. Okay, we're catching the Lamborghini of some type. Or is it the Ital Design Zeruno? I can't tell from here. I'm not yet that close. What difficulty they are on? Is that unbeatable? Oh, of course. Of course. Otherwise, I'd have already overtaken them all. Immediately into the first corner. Because even the unbeatable AI is easily beatable. Oh my god, they're so much quicker than me in a straight line. It's not fair. This is I have to break here. Or break here. She would both normally have to break for in most of these cars. They don't have to break there in anything. <laughs> I'm going to use the cheaty line as well. Because I need every advantage I can get. I can't even see what that is. Definitely oh, didn't almost massively crash there. <laughs> you would never do that. No. We are actually winning. Are we? Yeah, I'm, only two, I'm only two behind you. That's impressive. Why aren't you winning? You're in a quick car. Oh, I'm so getting caught. A massive difference as well. I'm so getting caught by that F50. And round the corner. Oh, we're catching people. Must have crashed. Must have all had a big pile up for me to catch them. Pat, I don't have to break here. Pat, everybody else has to break around that corner. I don't, because I'm going already at the speed that I would be going at if I was having to break for that corner. Yes, we're catching them. Yes. And they're driving away again. Oh, no. What a surprise. And the F50's coming back at me. Can we defend from the F50? I don't think I'm going to catch you guys up. I'm miles <laughs> behind. I don't know if this F50 is going to be able to overtake me. Or... Because he keeps having to break. Why is the AI breaking here? I don't plan to break until... Roundabout. It's like another... Eight kilometres or something. I can't even remember how far it is. And uh, we... And of course everyone's going to be feeling really nauseated by the fact that I keep looking behind me to make sure that I'm defending properly from this F50. Um, you see, this is why the Goliath is the most entertaining track in the game. Because you just sit on full throttle the whole time and do little taps of the steering wheel. Defending from this F50 is going to be hard. The whole rest of the race. Because I'm not catching up the people in front of it. Oh god, he nearly caught me. Just to put into perspective, by the way, everyone. That F50 is a 998. Oh, I, I got an overtake! Oh, and I forgot about the F50 in the process. Oh, that was a mistake. I got an overtake! Uh, luck luckily for me, one of the AIs crashed. Oh, you're not that far behind me, then. No. I think I'm about one corner behind. Yeah. Oh, now I've crashed, so don't know what's going on now. Oh, God. What on the leaderboard now? I actually kept my place. How did you manage that? Um, the braking zone. That might be the last breaking zone on this lap. Oh no, penultimate, I think. I think that's my penultimate. Uh, 
So I'm going to have to break on the exit of Broadway. And then I'm going to have to break on the really nasty downhill off camber right hand bend with the wall on the inside that I always end up going up. Uh, but I think that's it. Me flat out the whole way. Yay! Yeah, and this is why I like this car so much, because I don't have to break. Oh, no breaking here. I mean, it makes me feel a little bit better that at least I can still see the AI that are in front. I can't see you in front of me. No, no, you can't. What if you're gaining on me or if you're losing on me? I don't know, we don't get the Delta in this mode, do we? No, it's really oh, annoying. Okay. Um, okay, I've hit a wall, you're gaining on me. Oh, I've been overtaken by two AIs now. You forfeit our victory. Yeah. Because it's not me, because my... Go on, I... uh, You are much closer to the people in front of you than I am to the people in front of me. And the people in front of you are much slower. I have I no chance of catching up them. Again. Oh. I'm so bad. I oh. always like... And I've gone off... <laughs> I've gone off down the hill. What do we rely on you for? I need to get someone else in here. Get someone else you can play. Oh, wait, I'm catching these guys. Ooh, 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 can we get them? We've only got a few corners left. Can we get them? Remember, I do actually have to break for that corner, even though it doesn't... Maybe we can get Boris game. to play Forza. Nah, uh, Boris isn't... I don't think he owns it. What we call him? Probably just don't use his name. Ah, oh, I didn't win. That was me meant to be showcasing just how good a driver. Oh, I've got an idea. Yeah, um, everyone. That was the F50 we were racing earlier. Which is a 998. That's me. It was a 900. And the 998, I'm second. Wow. Okay, fifth. 962! You're 12 over, you allowed limit. That's I cheating. did say. Still? I did, I did tell you it was 960, and you didn't say. Uh... You didn't say anything about it then, so you can't really complain. I can complain as much as I would like. Whenever I would like. That is what I'm here to do. I am here to complain. Level 135. I keep leveling up. Why do I keep leveling up? It's not like I play this game much. Black cap. Yeah, I look like my granddad. Sounds like a good idea. So I hate getting all these clothes from wheel spins. I don't even know how to use them. <laughs> Go to your house. Oh, so these are the wheel spins, everyone. Uh, you go to your house and you put them on. And what you do is you let someone else dress your character so you end up being a girl. Ooh, fancy leggings. Yay. Right. Ooh, 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 ooh. I've got an idea. I challenge you... Oh, wait, no, 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 I don't want that. I challenge you to a head-to-head. -head. Yeah! I'm going to lose! I'm so going to lose! You are going to lose. That thing's all-wheel drive, isn't it? Oh my gosh, how fast is that thing? 
that's not allowed. It is a wall drive, and yeah. Right, will you do another one? You have no chance. Oh, another head to head. Yeah. Yeah. Go for that. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna do another head to head then. And let's just make it a bit fairer. Don't worry, it's stock. Stream, it's okay. not stock. You ready? Give me a moment. Are you getting in your F50 or something, or your Senna? No, I would never do that. Senna? I'm, I'm Absolutely guessing Absolutely not, yeah. Why well, have you driven off? I can't challenge you to a head-to-head -head if you drive off. Say where you were! Oh god, now I have to... You what? Ugh! Why do you keep spinning round? I have to get behind you to challenge you. Oh. <laughs> you are a nightmare. Oh. <laughs> oh, God, is that way? <laughs> That was a rubbish route you've picked. No, I don't pick the route, it's automatic. There you go. I think that was foul, wasn't it? Apparently I beat you. I don't think so. Don't worry, I have a plan. But for this one, I'm going to tell you not to pick my car. Is it a race? Is a race you're picking? Yeah, I, I think you're going to um, understand why. Um, given that I'm going to drive, um, actually, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna play relatively fair. Um, and I'm going to not drive a car that is stupidly fast. Just a car that's fast. You know, just, just a car that's reasonably quick. As reasonably. Opposed to, yeah, as opposed to arguably one of the quickest cars in the game. Well, just... And you're, I can see what you've picked as well. Forza bugs! Forza bugs. Would you rather I picked the 599 XXE? Probably not. Exactly. I've picked something reasonably fast, not something incredibly quick. Pretty reasonable car. Entirely affordable as well. Why's that? <sighs> I've got a few at home. Falls bugs, falls bugs. Uh, back out of that one. Back out, back out. Um. Back down now. Have you backed out? Join this one. You backed out. I'm frozen. Uh, falls oh, are fun. Nah. Falls are fun. <laughs> Falls are fun, falls are fun. We all love falls are fun. This is what we were talking about earlier, by the way, with the it never it does works. Work. It works sometimes. Sometimes for a little bit, and then you try something, and then try to do the same thing again, and it decides it's going to explode. I won't even let me go into the pause menu, because it's allocated in the server. Uh, you might have to reboot your game. Uh, I know, I agree. I can't even, can't even go into the pause menu to quit the game. Uh, alt tab. Yeah. Oh. This is, um, fun. Uh, 
I'm re rebooting it now. Um, in my full defense, oh, sorry, um, the idea to play Forza was entirely Sheaves. Uh, literally, he was the one that came up with the idea. I was expecting to play a different game. And he. Um, what do you expect me to play? Well, I was expecting you want to play Battlefront. That's what I was used to play. Save that. Save that for later. Not late. Not later today, but like later another time. Yeah, yeah, probably. Um, and um, he came up with the idea of Forza, and my immediate reaction, and I'm I'm going to do it. Uh, it was over messages though, so he doesn't know this. Was <sighs> bugs, uh, which, which yeah, pr pretty much does just sum up Forza. Though to be fair, to be fair to Forza, Battlefront is in no way free of game annihilating bugs. It has plenty of them. Uh, such as everybody in the game having immortality so that you can't fight each other. That, that being was a fun one. Yeah. The most recent completely game destroying bug. Which basically meant and I've crashed. Uh, meant everyone uh, stopped playing the game for ages. And some of the game's most esteemed players refusing to play on PC. And round and round the corner we go. Yeah, I think it's the high downforce cars that are just a bit twitchy for my liking. Because the IDR does it sometimes as well. I quite like the IDR. Because of that. The fact that you can just take it from standstill and just drift it. Because it loves being sideways. And any car that loves being sideways loves being driven by me. Because I am normally sideways. And hopefully not in a tree. Uh, which is a slight specialty of mine. There we go, that should work. Take him in your combo again now. Yeah. Uh, so, hopefully this will work. Hopefully. Has it brought you in? Not yet. I'm in your convoy, but it's not brought me into any game. Oh. This might bring an, an end to us playing Forza tonight. Ooh. Ooh, I've crashed. Checking car restrictions. IDR. Creating event. Yeah, sideways, you can get an idea. About the worst car to go through drift zones. Because, like, that doesn't count as proper drift in it, to a drift zone. It's annoying. But it looks cool. It does. And as everyone knows, a sideways IDR is all that matters. Oh, I've cancelled the event. Oh, it's letting me in now. Um, oh. This is it gets working. Well, I, I accidentally pressed the button that used to be drift on my old controller layout. Um, are you ready to be dragged in? Yeah. See, this is why we don't play Forza. Because it's the buggiest game on the planet. Oh, well, uh, it's unable to join the session next to view network diagnostics. Oh, uh, joy. 100% reliability. I need that um, uh, thing I sent Panda. Cats fixing the PC that Panda uses when stuff isn't working. Right. Falls has been really buggy. Yeah, cars are just 
changing colour for no reason. Ooh, fun. I wonder if I go into a solo race then. If it fixes itself afterwards. Yeah, give it a go. Um... We'll do one of this in a much quicker car than last time. Uh, solo. Yeah, trap toys will be fine. In the IDR. Shall we check that the settings is... Kitty's fixing the computer. Yes, Panda. Kitties are always needed to fix the computer. And um, I need to... Yeah. I just need a load of kitties to fix my computer then, don't I? Difficulty settings. What have we got? Unbeatable. Uh, no ABS. Simulation steering. No traction control. No stability control. That doesn't matter. I can put that on manual clutch. Yeah, it makes no difference. Driving line because I like to know if I need to brake sometimes. No damage and tire wear because usually I can't finish a race if I've got that turned on. That'll be a fun thing to end with, actually. Uh, and rewind, of course, because otherwise you're going to crash. Yeah, we've got to do something with damage turned on. Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, look, we can beat the uh, MC12 in front of us. Uh, the TVR to our side, Moslers. Uh, is that an F40? I can't even see what that one is that I've just overtaken. So this is Forza where you all just shunt each other all the time and then you exploit the fact that the AI doesn't block the inside and just completely dart down the side of it. Why are there still three cars in front of me? So it'll be these three cars that are then the really quick ones that I'm not actually able to overtake in the course of the entire race because I've forgotten how to actually overtake people. Is that an Apollo IE in front of me? This is... um car recognition game now and how can i talk and drive at the same time that's the real challenge the talking and the driving so that's the apollo ie we've been Played doing it for an hour and 20 minutes yeah but this is talking and driving properly and we've just passed the hoonigan spec ford f-150 pickup truck and i don't even know what's in front i don't even see it and speed 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 and brake and speed, 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 and brake. And speed. Full speed. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was a crash. Slight crash. Only a little crash. And on we go. Ooh, I didn't break that. Oh, I've only got one lap to catch that thing, and it's way out in front of me. Brake. Brake blast. What is that thing? I don't see where it is. Well, I'm not gaining on it, which is not a good sign. Because usually I like to beat the AI. Oh, it's going to give me that stupid message at the end going, do you need to turn the AI difficulty down? No, I want to lose. Losing is fun. Because losing means I need to drive quicker. I was always found with the AI difficulty setting that, like, you turn it down when it tells you to, and you just instantly win everything and you turn yeah. it up to the next one and it just bugs you every time to change it back. That was the radical. <laughs> yeah, that is a nice car actually. I want one. What if my girlfriend will let me get one when I'm older? Or older. Do I get a message from him in a minute going, No, not allowed. Not allowed. Don't worry, they're not that loud. And not that polluting. Do I try and join my um, convoy? Yeah. I top up my water because it's been more than five minutes since I've last topped up my pint of water. And that's the people who are reminding who don't drink, remind it to drink. Because it's important and it's good for you. Um, you all know who you are who don't drink, of course. Uh, and Panda, that does also apply to you, of course. Right. 
Um, are you in my convoy then, yeah? No, I'm not online. No. Oh, I should have clicked that while I was still getting ready. But I'm online now, so you should be able to get in. Oh, I want to just report some lies that this thing is providing me. Yeah. Where's, where's my mouse gone? Let's go into menu. My mouse. So up here, it says that I'm using 60%... Uh, 60 FPS. I'm getting 60% GPU usage. Actually, we'll just make it a bit bigger. Go. So here... You can all see, 60% uh, 60 FPS, and that's like 65% um, percent GPU usage. Now, I'm going to explain to you all how that is a lie. While Mr. Sheev tries to work his way um, into the match. Yeah, it's not going well. Well, that's a uh, falls for you. Uh, it's, apparently, I'm no longer online. So... That is a lie, because over here, I can bring on my task manager, which tells me all of what's going on on my computer. And as you can see, my CPU uh, will go back down to 60%, but the readout that Forza is giving me is my GPU, which is on 25%. And this is what um, OBS is doing to encode my stream. It lies and i have to ask why it's using so much cpu when it's a should be gpu bound given how the application works to do with all of the technical stuff that nobody wants to hear about because it's all boring okay. apparently it's me that's having problems with getting online all right yeah because i'm in a live session yeah so apparently i'm not Ooh, and that's a treat you try joining me? Uh, no, because I'm not online. Oh, don't tell me this means I'm the one that actually needs to reboot. Much easier when I can blame someone else. There's no reason why it should be me that has a problem. There's no reason why it should be me who had a problem before, though. Well, yeah, yeah there's every reason it should be you. Always you. It's always Xbox. But well, yeah. Right, I wonder. I put myself into a... Specifically into a Horizon Solo. Still not in a Horizon Solo. I'm very tempted just to relaunch the game. Oh, the delights of Forza. Ah. Crashing into everything. I didn't hit anything. Right, I'm now in the Horizon Solo properly. If I now try to connect to online, and if we give this, let's say, a minute and a half, and if it doesn't work within a minute and a half, um, Panda gets to put off playing Stars Battlefront 2 for one more week. Why did I? Why did I say that? That's a terrible idea, and I now know I'm going to get hold, held to it. Panda, don't you dare hold me to that one. Um, actually, you've already put off way more than a week and a half. Panda, definitely hold him to it. No, 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 Panda, not allowed. No, 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 Panda, not allowed. Not allowed. Actually, it'll be putting off a week and a half if you don't do it. Turn to free roam to accept. I'm already in free roam. Now, Panda, you do not get that privilege because if we don't do it on Sunday, that'll have been putting it off for a week. So putting it off for a week and a half would mean that we do it on Wednesday, which is triple XP, which would be the best day to play. Oh, um, I am going to mute for you all so that you don't have to hear the horrible noises as it loads and I'm gonna oh. um and Mr. Sheev you are 
uh, also muted. Um, while the really loud, horrible noises of the loading screen play. This is where Panda's going to spam me in chat. And then you get really loud. Oh, I got the music turned off. But no, I haven't. But I'll just leave it muted and Mr. Sheev also muted. Just while we get through the loading stuff because it's horrible. I'll, I'll unmute now. There we go. All fixed. And Panda. Everyone can stop you. All we have to do is wait for you to forget. Or tell you to be organised. You'll never manage that. Disorganised, forget. Last one minute. Right. See, I now count this as it fixed, because I've managed to reboot in a minute and a half. So I, I now declare what this if fixed. it doesn't fix it, though? No, I declare this fixed until proven otherwise, and currently this is fixed. Look, I can get myself into a race easily. I, yep. And yes, Panda, you are a genius, just not a genius of organization. Uh, this is fixed, by the way, actually. You should be able to join me in it. Panda, you don't get the say, you're not the one streaming. <laughs> and that is the rule that we follow. The streamer is always the one in charge. Someone in chat tell Panda that they're, that, that they're wrong, please. No, it did not take 1 minute and 40 seconds. It was instant. Because that's Xbox. It's all instant. Nope. No, no, no. No so's. We were instant. And the panda is always wrong. Because the panda isn't streaming. The panda could always join me on the stream. And then the panda would be able to say that it's wrong. Your, your timer was wrong. See, um... Here we go, let's try fix it. Yeah. Well, you've not sent me the in well, you've not um joined yet. That's not my fault. I fixed it. You've not joined Have the invite. I'm online. I could join your game, but I'm not going to. Right, how do we how do we okay, just so there is a slight possibility it was my fault then? Your fault all along, yep, yep. See Panda. Not my fault all along, no, 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 my no, fault no, was no, for the no, last no, five no. seconds. Shush, shush. otherwise I'm gonna mute you. Um Panda, as I think you Panda's tell, right. No, 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 no. Panda, as I you can tell... I'm not even 100% sure what Panda's I'm, saying, but I'm just going to go with, yeah, Panda's right. I am going to mute you if you are not careful. Oh, know. no. Yeah, anyway. You've never been muted before. You are clipping, so I'm going to turn you down. Um, as Chief just confirmed, Panda... I am in fact right, because he is too useless to be able to accept an invite entirely. That actually, and there is no other not explanation at all. all. I'm going to mute you. I am threatening to mute you. I am officially threatening to mute you. And also turn you down, which I will definitely do, because you're still flipping. What car are you driving? That one. Yeah, what do you think? I think I'm going to drive a slow car. Oh. Yes. I'd never drive a slow car. Oh, I can get around that corner. Perfect. Oh, and wall. See, look, Panda, it's worked. First try. Hmm. Now then, I put my chances at winning this race at 200%. And in fact... What track? What track? Uh, or ambleside what... Sprint. Yeah. Yep, Ambleside Sprint. Yep. The 40 oh, mile version. Oh, Ambleside Sprint. In fact, Panda, I'm going to make a wager with you. If I don't win... I will play Valorant on stream with you. Twice more before I force you to play Battlefront. Twice more. Oh, well, that AI just bugged into me. Told you they are buggy. Yeah, but also the AI crashes more than me. You see, the way I know I can win this is this is a custom track. 
and the AI are almost guaranteed to crash on a custom track. And I also know that I'm guaranteed to beat you. Yeah. So I know. Um, it's Sheev Panda, um, who is my secret background minion, usually, um, who we're bringing into the spotlight for once. Yeah, I <laughs> that day I crashed. Games. I always beat you in games, though, don't I? So. Yeah, yeah, 100% of the time. Oh, I didn't see you. I see oh, the map, AI just crashed into me. <laughs> Um, Panda, it's really simple. S H E E V. Um, and anyone who can guess the reference where that name is from, uh, well incredibly done. Incredibly impressed. Anyone who can guess the reference where my name's from, we're more impressed. Yes, and if anyone knows what the numbers mean, we'll be incredibly impressed. <laughs> yeah, that'd be impressive. Yes, Panda, that is how you spell it. And yes, Panda, it is Star Wars. But the, the the key bit is which bit of Star Wars. Yeah. You know, it, it's it's not impressive to guess that the person who is Star Wars obsessed picked a Star Wars name. Okay. It's not impressive to guess that the person making an obscure reference is just gonna, it's just going to be Star Wars. Yeah. I mean, like, what, are, yeah. What else so are you going to make an group? obscure reference to? Yeah. Like realistically, th there's nothing else with just the same level of obscure. You know, you've got Marvel, where, like, you can make references and things like Marvel, uh, but th there's no other thing where you've got the same level of obscurity in something that everybody's heard of. Um, are you even, like, in the same race as me? Yes. <laughs> I am seventh. Panda, this is not looking good for you. Looks like you're going to be playing Battlefront very soon. Let get that download started. Did it's you know? 90 gig or something. Yeah, 90 gig download. EA have a new app that you can use to play their games. Uh, as opposed to Origin. And it looks just as terrible. And what's really funny about it is it doesn't share your playtime between the two apps. So, say in a purely hypothetical world, someone had a thousand hours in Star Wars Battlefront 2. Uh, it wouldn't display it on this new app. It would instead say they've got, I don't know, about an hour's playtime. And Panda, no, I am not buying any more storage. You made me reinstall Windows so that I could play Valorant for you. I think you should buy Panda some more storage space. Am I, uh, am I meant to? Right. So, how we can do that? Okay, I will agree to buy Panda more storage space if I hit 15,000 subscribers. In the next minute. No, no, no. Uh, not going to put any... No, if I hit 15,000 subscribers, I will buy Panda more storage space. Someone might have to remind me, because this could be in 100 years' time. But yeah, when I hit 15,000 subscribers... I will buy Panda more storage space. And I, I you know, I buy Panda some reasonable storage space. <laughs> Time to start working. Yes. Um, Panda and I do have a secret battle plan um, for over the summer. For some rapid expansion of both our channels. Uh, their Twitch and my YouTube. Um, if you're wondering what Panda's Twitch is, they're not linked in the description of... This, how are you second to last? Um, second to last is the second to last biggest loser. Mm. Yes, we do. This is, yes, it's very secret, Panda. So secret that you've forgotten, apparently. Um, yeah, so Panda and I have a secret battle plan to rapidly... You did know about it. You came up with it. With a little bit of help, but most of it was your idea. And we're not going to spoil the fact that we're going to use a, a multi-platform strategy to grow our channels. You did know about it. You definitely knew about it because you did come up with it. I'm going to have to remind Panda about this later. <laughs> oh, 
Panda, it was the thing to do with your college course. <sighs> Why do we trust Panda with anything? Literally the idea Panda came up with. No, Panda, you don't have to do anything. That, that was why it was a genius idea. We don't have to rely on you. Actually, you know, you'd have to do something. But you agreed to do that something regardless. You get to do some nice, fun 3D modelling, I think. I think that's what I'm going to make you suffer with. Oh, I got shunted off there by an AI. That's so annoying. <laughs> Are you not Don't reading... That you're not able to read chat at the same time as um driving me yeah not really i mean i'd have still cr i'd still crash while i was reading chat or not <laughs> just how how many times yeah panda you should remember it wasn't that long ago only a few weeks i remember probably because it was the plan of how to explode my channel secret battle plan and then might have the side effect of exploding yours as well, hopefully. Then you can buy yourself some storage. You set yourself up with some 3D modelling. That was all. And maybe a bit of development. Nothing too difficult. Nothing I couldn't do. And nothing you can't already do. Just might help to get a little bit. Because I remember that house that you modelled. That thing was... Um, I have nightmares about that. I don't know how I'd explain why I have nightmares about that. How do I explain 3D modelling to people who don't do 3D modelling? Oh, I was expecting to turn left there. Um, so what happened was... So Panda's... I don't know what Panda said. But Panda does um, little bits of 3D modelling every now and again. And... Um, oh! Oh! You do day to day um you put that in chat and then I'll, I'll try and explain it a bit i don't know if that's something you talk about or o's <laughs> am i allowed to talk about what you do or is it or just shh <laughs> i i would hope you've improved I need you to send me project files so I can have a look. Yeah, Alex. Uh, sure, it'll be a very fair critiquing, won't it? It won't be judgmental law. I, I would never be judgmental. Eh, go ahead. Go ahead. It okay. won't be a... It won't be a, oh, that's really good. It'll be a, you're literally useless. <laughs> I would never tell anyone they're useless, but Ted, you are useless. So what what um, Panda does uh, is game design at college. Um, and they're quite good at it, actually. Um, and what I do um, is a lot in my spare time is 3D modelling. Uh, as in, I do a lot of 3D modelling. I've got a lot of practice, and I know a lot of different modelling programmes. And for those of you that do know anything about 3D modeling, I have used 3ds Max, Maya, Houdini, Cinema 4D, Blender, and I feel like I'm forgetting some. Um, I started off using Fusion 360, which is a CAD program. So when Panda was starting off doing game design, uh, they were having some problems, as anybody who starts trying to do 3D modeling will, because it is impossibly difficult. And so they sent me um, a house that they'd been told to make. And I took one look at it and went, Ugh. Because um, if you were to take the house and just look at it at face value, it looked really nice and really pretty. Uh, because Panda is very good at making things look good. But if you took it to what we call wireframe view, which tells you where all the edges are in it and all the edges that you can't normally see that make up the house... Um, it was a little bit of a nightmare. And a little bit of something you don't necessarily want to see. Um, and I still have nightmares of that today. Because it was a bit of an abomination. But, as Panda says, they have, hopefully, 
massively improved. Because I haven't actually seen any of your 3D modeling. You need to send me photos. Any photos or files. Send me files. I want to see files. Um, but, um, well, how much of a 3D modeler I am is uh, my uh, thumbnail, my starting soon screen, and my profile picture, I think it's called on YouTube, um, are all things that I've 3D modeled. Uh, all in several seconds. I've read it out. Um, Shiv, I can't even see you. Yeah, I'm second to... No, third to last. Yeah, but I can't even see second place, so Panda, it is not looking good for you. All the AI are bunched <laughs> up, but they're quite ahead of me. So, Panda, is the trick for watching... Having a look at your models, then, if I don't want to see the wireframe view, to just maybe just never look at the wireframe view and just pretend that's not there? And that's not a very good um, way of working for a... Um, 3D modeler for game design because in game design you want to be minimizing your poly count, which means wireframes all you want to look at. Because more polys equal slower performance, which is why cars are really nasty to work with because they're all really high poly. I need to find some of the stuff that I've done that's been good poly mod. I've had things that have been like multiple millions of polygons, so. You can't feel too bad, Panda, because I don't think you're ever going to end up as many polygons as I've had. Well, I thought I was going to hit that wall there. Got lucky. Um, I, w I would like to call it skill. I would not. Well, look repeated enough times is a skill. Uh, and that was no, getting very Yeah, well, it depends if you... You can repeat the luck when it's important, though. I can always repeat the luck when it's important. To me. And of course, my metric of what's important to me is entirely arbitrary and basically just depends on when I've already got no, lucky. paradox, really, because your, your metric for whether it's important or not is whether you do well at it. Exactly. So, so what you're saying is you're always lucky at things when you do well. Anything Panda, you don't do... Panda, you know I'm not just lucky. Not just lucky. I am remarkably lucky in gaming. Because there are, most of the time, I just... People say, oh, that was, you, you know, you have this bit of technique that's good. I'm just like, do I? I didn't know I was doing that. I just kind of found that something happened when I did that. Oh, okay. It's like when, um, on Sunday, Panda, I think you said about... I uh, shooting pattern or something? I can't remember. Um, about how I shoot three times and then stop shooting. And I did not know I did that. I just shot in a way that seemed to work. Um, and I hoped for the best. Actually last now. <laughs> Still can't see anyone. Oh, wait, no, I can just about catch a glimpse of someone if I look back at the right angle. Now, one of the driver tiles I can just catch a glimpse of. Just. Uh, let's see what happens. Uh, wanna... Knowing that this... um. I sent a picture of wireframe. Have you sent it on Discord, Panda? Absolutely no way I'll put that on stream. Yeah, if your teacher at college saw that, I wouldn't be very happy, would they? What? With the wireframing, you say it was bad. Well, I don't think they, they actually care at college. Uh Because that only really becomes a problem when you start using it properly. And typically when you're learning things at school or at college or something like that, you don't really know how it works in the real world. I mean, the best example of that is take A-level maths. It has no practical application for anyone. But you have to do it. 
That's always such a fun corner. This car is so dull to drive. It's so dull. So slow. Incredibly slow. Oh, 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 oh. Did it crash? That's a bit of a crash there. That's my le least favourite corner. Um, come around, 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 around. But right, I'm nearly done. I am not. I'm what on eighty-nine percent. Eighty-nine percent. So you are ten percent behind me. Also known as four miles. I can't see anyone. This should not last. Second to last. Oh, you can see that anyway. Yeah. But that's not last. Will I finish? Absolutely not. Right. The last thing I did on this was I uh, drove an AI inside of a house. Because <laughs> you'd already given up. Well, uh, I still kept my place. Oh my god. It was like four seconds before the race ended and I just crashed them. Panda, you need to send me that on Discord so I can... So, can you send me the project file, Panda? If you're still there. So I can open it up in 3DS and show everyone. You go confuse everyone by bringing up other things. Oh, I don't want another flat cap. Why ever not? Oh, we want a flat cap. Well, I got a in the hall of the mountain king horn. I reckon we do a Goliath with damage on then. Yeah, well, that was last race. Yeah, it was last race. Do bumper cars. No, 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 that is not my plan. Right. Settings. This is for everyone's benefit. We're going to make this fun. Shifting, manual clutch, driving line off, damage and tire wear, simulation, rewind, off. Hardest difficulty settings in the game. Right. Then we go to the Goliath. We select our race. PvP. Back on. Custom events. One where we can pick any car. Am, am I not allowed to look at project files, Panda? Please, can I see a project file? What do you tell me? Oh, let me have a look. Yeah, let's have a look. I'm not going to embarrass you too much. Probably just say how it's impressive, because that looked like sculpting, and sculpting doesn't tend to have low mesh counts. What car do we drive, then? Uh... I don't want something super fast. So go on class, sort by class. Yeah, I am. Yeah. Remember, you've got oh. 15 second delay. Yeah. No. Um, stock I8. Did you like that one? Oh, I'm quite fond of it. Oh, I've got a colourful one. Xbox Chameleon. Oh, God, I'm <laughs> manual, aren't I? <laughs> Hope you're actually... Wait, I don't know if it'll make you do the gears, will it? Be interesting. Oh, God, I don't even know what the buttons are. Yeah, I have to remember. 
Is it the same as... Set a course, sir? Uh, no idea. I don't know what the default is. I got no oh, idea God. what the default is. So I am playing on the hardest difficulty. I don't know if, what settings affect you. Oh, Panda says the files are too big. Powerful. You got to do manual or are you automatic? No, I'm automatic. Okay. I'll tell you a secret. You're going to lose because you've drifted. I'm definitely going to crash. Yeah. The secret to driving like this is to drive well within your limits. Yes, this is the chameleon car. That's a mouse. The ultimate chameleon car. How are you doing, Sheev? Oh, I'm actually quite close behind you. Yeah, you won't be by the end of it. Come on, please crash. I'm not going to crash. I'm driving this thing so safely. Annoyingly, I've not got my display up that will um, tell me um, what where I've got. I don't remember how to... I had a control scheme that used to let me bring it up. I don't remember where that is. Yeah, hopefully I just don't run into any of the problems. But I remember only ever being able to get about two thirds of the way around the Goliath before losing all grip. So I might have a chance then if I can conserve my tyres better. Oh, no, 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 no. That's really bad. That's really bad. That's really bad. That means I'm down on power now. And you lost the place. Yeah, well, I can make that up. But also, that skidded my tyres a load. This is going to be hard. And if I mess a gear change up, I damage my gearbox. I think I get, over the whole um, race, 20 mess-ups before the gearbox gets wrecked. And if I wreck the gearbox, I can't change gear. No. The better hope I'm in I fourth gear. That problem. See, as I said, I can make the time up. Oh yeah, you're right behind me already. It's just hopefully our tyres go off at the same time. I did tell you to sit to the left around that corner. I did. Not enough, that's why you're drifting around it. Or maybe you Probably just... shouldn't be smoking my tyres on this, should I? Yeah, you'll wear them away super quickly. Unless the AI-8 happens to have really strong tyres. No!
you are. That was uncalled for. <laughs> was that uncalled for? Yes. Um, I don't know if that actually showed up on my stream, but what I did was um, I knew that the bridge was um, indestructible there. So I was just lining him up on the bridge, which is why I went so quiet. Because I was making sure I got that perfect. Yeah, you see it on the stream. Okay, that's good. Because it, it was key that that was a flawless um, shunt as well. Because if I missed, um, I would end up in the bridge. Which wouldn't be very good for me, given I've already it's had not... a bit of a shunt. I should just start drifting now. No, 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 you might be able to catch me if I mess it up. That's the one thing that I do find annoying about racing games. is It's one little mistake like that. Um, and it's completely over. And that little mistake can be, you know, messing up by a tenth of a second. And it's all completely over. My steering's actually broken. That's what. So's mine. I keep veering off to the right. Yeah. Probably because of that bridge. Yeah, my um, steering damage is quite subtle. I don't know how well it'll come across on stream. It very slightly pulls off towards the right, but not not enough yet to cause a problem. But if I have another crash, it's over. We know steering. Luckily, I don't think we were at any um, dangerous spots. That type of front-on crashes soon. Definitely down on power, but not much. Here we go. Uh, we're going to... Don't manage to persuade the panda to send me project files. Way too embarrassed for that. I'm down on quite a bit of power as well. Yeah, he probably will be. Come on! Oh, you're miles back. Oh, oh, that was way too fast into there. Getting the steering's damaged. Come on, crash into something. I'm not going to. There's only one spot that I... I'm likely to crash... Well, no. So there's two spots that I'm likely to crash into a destructible object for the rest of this race. And do you know what I'm going to do about both of those corners? What? I'm going to go... Super slow. What do you mean the project file's too powerful, Banda? As I said, too big. It's what it says on Discord if your files are too big. Oh! Uh, you got... And Google Drive Panda. Or something like that. Google Drive doesn't yeah, take that. This one has like 8 megabyte limit. That's terrible. Even just a photo taken on a phone will be bigger than that. Yeah, I think my phone does like 20 megabyte photos. Yeah. And it's not even an expensive phone. It's a cheap, terrible thing. I wish I could see how much damage I've taken on my car. I could work out if I have enough left to be able to boil it before the end of the race. Everything's too much effort for you, Panda. It doesn't take long. Quick, Panda, before I finish the race. Eee. And left. And right. And break! And I kind of want to drift around this next corner. And keep it flatter. And on and on and on we go. God, this car is so slow. Should have picked a quicker car. Yeah, should have done. Should have picked that aerial nomad or something. Imagine going around in that thing. 
Imagine going around in the 599XXE. Tires would be Down blown by now. Right, I'm about to approach the really difficult nasty corner that I hate. Um, break, 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 break. There we go. Uh, go. And round we go the other way. Okay, I'm about to get to the nasty corner. Oh, we can still see you, though. Yeah, pretty close. Well, 17 seconds. That's not bad. So, oh, still 17. If I have a big crash, then that'll be you in front. So what is like is that happening when you almost done the race? Uh, quite high. Given I just went through that flat. Which is a really bad idea. Because I'm still driving competitively, which is a really bad idea at this stage in the race. I am definitely breaking for that corner. Thank you, Panda. And certainly breaking a lot for that corner. Um, well, the final straight, or, well, stretch, not really a final straight, is it? Final straight doesn't really last very long. No. Alright, will I get to finish the race? Just about, I think. And zoom! And of course, because we love having fun, Sideways. Right. Let's start getting. Oh, I definitely get to finish. Oh, oh that's a huge file, Panda. How big? So. 100 meg mesh. That's huge. I don't know if I can load that. Blend. Ah, oh, Blender installed. Right, this is 3DS Max, everyone. Uh, it's loading in the background while we just finish off with Forza. Forza loves to just leave you in screens for ages. Go oh, love your huge files. Right, let's find a nice nice screenshot to end with, since we had a nice screenshot to start with. Uh what's a pretty car? Pretty car, pretty car. Um Go for this one. This is crazy. All the Toyota CHR. Go. Get sideways. So, this has been Forza Horizon 4. Um, arguably one of the best of racing games. Um, not a particularly good simulator, but not meant to be. Uh, a lot of fun very, playing it, though. Yeah, very fun and incredibly pretty. I mean... Mm, I mean we play other games that are more realistic, like a set of course, but, I mean, nothing beats this just for entertainment. Yeah, and how good it looks. Apart from 5, but, again, we'll get on 5 soon. Enough. So, 
Now to have a quick look at 3DS Max, because that is always fun. So, this is 3DS Max. Um, I'm just going to go to my starting soon screen for a second. While I work out how to, or to see if I can get Panda's thing in. I'm not sure because it's a blend file and I can't open blend files, Panda. I can't open blend files. Don't know what to do. Don't know what to do, Panda, because I can't open the blend file. I think we might have to leave that one. Should we have a look at. We can look at something else, Techie. Because Techie stuff is always fun. Is it? What? Is it? Yeah, always. Uh, that's the wrong thing. Got another thing I'm working on. Let's get rid of 3DS, because that's a nightmare. Little tease of what we're working on here. Um, down we go down. Look, see, it's it's like black magic. It's running in DOS. Or well, looks like it's running in DOS. This is uh, the true speed. Yeah, Panda, if you can get me an X, FBX file, that'd be good. Um, come on. Let's see how this is going. So here we have running, uh, hopefully very shortly, is a deep fake model, um, which will be something I will be thinking about putting a tutorial um, about somewhere uh, because they're cool. And I kind of want to let everyone know just how easy they are to do because it really is something that um, scares me just how anyone can do a deep fake and how realistic they can get um, but I'm kind of surprised this hasn't loaded yet usually this is pretty snappy and I'm going to presume my audio quality is terrible I bet my CPU is at 100%. Well, it's working it out. Oh, please tell me this will work as well. Chief, are you still there? Yeah, I'm just uh, not understanding anything. <sighs> I'm slightly surprised. But this hasn't loaded. Definitely loaded something into RAM because we're using 17 gigs of it. Definitely doing something on the graphics card because we're using 10 gigs of VRAM. Something's happening on the CPU. So hopefully it will be working. There you go. Definitely doing something. And a lot of something. What that something is, I don't know. I hope we've stopped using the graphics card. No, I haven't. Let's have all the fun. Bug fixing with Scion. But it's not actually a bug, it's probably an intended feature. I presume what it's trying to do is compile it all into its VRAM, but it shouldn't take that long. Oh, don't tell me it's Windows. No, it's not Windows doing it. Hmm. They don't know. 
This is beyond me. Yeah. I'm confused now. I don't know. Yeah, we'll show the interesting bit. So, what we have is uh, hidden away the dark depths of my um, disk drive. And a few thousand photos of you and McGregor from the Phantom Menace. And we're going to see if we can make people look like you and McGregor. Because why not? And since I started this on May the 4th, that kind of explains the Star Wars. Nice timing. Yeah. That was the inspiration, really. Um, but this is quite possibly one of the biggest collections of Ewan McGregor photos in the world. Um, which I would say is an achievement, really, more than anything else. To have 8,819 photos of Ewan McGregor. And just Ewan McGregor, as you can see. Can't see anybody else on there. I hope. I hope I've not got anybody else. It'd be a bit annoying. Yeah. Lots and lots of Ewan McGregor photos. And then some of them need to be made to go. Because they don't look. I to see all of them slowly load in. Very slowly. Very slowly. This one here where you've got stuff in front of it, you have to get rid of them. Yeah, I'm thinking at some point of doing a deep fake tutorial because it really is just as simple coming into here and clicking on one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, done. It really is that easy, uh, which I think is quite impressive, um, given the complexity. Um, I think I'm going to end this um, here because mm. we have been going for. Two hours and while. twenty minutes. I think Panda's had to yeah, go. That means we won't be able to get the FBX in a reasonable time scale. So And all this deep fake's a bit too complicated for most people. Yeah, it's something where I need to sit down and write a script for it, I think. So yeah. Thank you very much for joining everyone. Uh, of course the obligatory please uh like and subscribe, of course, because I have to say that because it's part of the job. Um, of course, any engagement is better than nothing. So, if you have hated my anything, then a dislike's fine because that's still engagement and that's still a positive thing as far as YouTube is concerned. Uh, so, I don't mind, uh, but I'd always prefer a like because it makes me happy. Uh, we will be back at some point. Shiva and I will probably stream again next Friday. I might stream some point before then with Panda or something, depending on oh. if Panda remembers to turn up. Probably either doing a bit more Forza or maybe some Battlefront. Yeah, or maybe might even stray as far as a different game. Different uh, but, game? Yeah, there aren't many of them that we play. Yeah, um, thank you very much, everyone, and I hope you have. Uh, well, I was going to say good evening, but good night's sleep, I think, if you're in England. Um, bye.